There is only one way to start this video. Welcome to Miyajima. I know you've seen this image. I know you have. I mean, you may have seen a similar image, if not this exact one, but there's no doubt that somewhere, somehow, your eyes have seen this. This is a hallmark of the island of Miyajima, Japan. And whenever I bring a group here, I can absolutely count on people just standing and absorbing this view for about five minutes straight. And if you'd like to see it with your own eyes, well, let me show you how. The island of Miyajima is located off the coastline of Hiroshima. Let me explain it this way. I'll grab this little section of Japan and let's zoom in. There we go. Now, this is Hiroshima and this is the island of Miyajima. And if you don't know anything about Miyajima Island, well, here's a few details for you. Miyajima is about 45 minutes off the coastline of the city of Hiroshima, and you can access the island by ferry. It's nicknamed Shrine Island for the world-famous shrine named Itsukushima that rests in the water for all to see. The population of Miyajima Island is slightly over 2,000 after the population estimate of December 2016. Miyajima was once a volcano, and by the way, that isn't really a shock. There are more dormant volcanoes in Japan than you can possibly imagine. Although, as I mentioned above, the island supports about 2,000 citizens, 4 million people per year visit this spot. To get to Miyajima, you simply take a train to Miyajima Station, and then you use your train pass for a free ferry ride to the island. The ferry is comfortable, and two ferries take turns going from one side to the other. The ferry ride provides a great view of the island, and it'll only take about 20 minutes max. Once you're on the island, you can expect to see deer everywhere. Deer inhabit the island, and they are welcome citizens. You can walk right up to them, snap pictures or video. According to one tourism representative that I spoke to on the island, there are usually between 3,000 and 3,500 deer on the island. On the beaches of Miyajima, you might see wedding photographs being taken and thousands of people taking the one-of-a-kind selfies and memorable photos for remembrances. Walking tours are available for those who are interested and as the tide recedes off the beach, tourists instantly hop on the wet sand, for a chance to walk up to Itsukushima and touch it with their own hands. On the island, there's lots to do. Play on the beach, enjoy some shopping, dining at a restaurant of your choice, purchasing souvenirs, or a casual stroll through town, or even riding a gondola high into the mountains, and you can hike to the very top for an amazing view. There are few places in this nation that provides such a unique glimpse of real Japan. If you'd like more information on the great island of Miyajima, we have some fantastic recommendations and links right below this video, or you can contact me or my staff directly. For journeytojapan.com, I'm Carl Rosa. Thanks for watching.